Uh, how would you describe your mood in three words? I'd say uh, hungry, sleepy, but motivated. Uh, what's the best part about being a treehouse teacher? Uh, definitely interacting with the students uh, and all the learning that comes with it. What are you currently reading? I am reading a couple of books, the one on functional programming and JavaScript, and another book on why students don't like school. Interesting. Uh, which language is the best for an absolute beginner to learn? I'd say JavaScript. Uh, JavaScript is everywhere. A lot of the patterns you learn in JavaScript are common to other programming languages. What are your favorite tools and why? Definitely Chrome DevTools, because you can uh, inspect exactly how the page was built and styled. And recently, I've been using the Firefox Grid Inspector tool, which lets you work with the new CSS Grid layout spec, so you can visualize exactly how you built your grid uh, in the browser. What would you do in life if money weren't an issue? I'd probably live in the down in the Florida Keys and be on the water most days, but uh, still code and teach for sure. Who was your favorite teacher? It, my favorite teacher was uh, Mr. Davis. He was my music teacher back in high school. I was in band. What inspired you to learn to code? Well, I knew that uh, it was challenging, uh, but also being able to design with code, right? So the instant gratification you get when you code something, and then you see it work sometimes. What is the best band or musician in all history? Uh, if we're talking history, uh, I'll kick it back to old school jazz, uh, Louis Armstrong and uh, Duke Ellington. What is your greatest challenge as a treehouse teacher? Making difficult concepts easier for students to learn. I'd say that's pretty challenging. What are you looking forward to learning this year? Definitely more functional programming with JavaScript. Uh, where would you like to travel next? Portland, Oregon. If you were to give yourself advice back when you were a kid, what would you say? Uh, probably stop thinking you know it all or uh, learn how to play guitar and piano. I always wanted to learn how to do those. What web browser do you use? I use Chrome. What was the first time you uh, encountered a real world problem that you solved by building an app? Uh, I, I once built a GIF searching app back before it was cool. That was fun. Mac or PC, currently Mac. Which accomplishment are you proud of most? Uh, besides being here on set with you wonderful people each month? Um, I'd say recently traveling to Europe and speaking to large crowds of developers about something I care about a lot, which is coding. What do you think is going to be the most interesting development in technology in the next five years? Uh, I'm interested in the uh, IoT, Internet of Things advancements, also in the uh, evolution uh, of certain JavaScript libraries like React and React Native. I think those are going to be totally different in the next three to five years and really interested in, in seeing where that's going. What personal projects are you working on? Uh, currently, I'm working on a project to get more practice with Node and Express. Uh, so it's like an outdoorsy kayaking and paddleboarding app where you get tide times, weather, wind speeds, uh, just based on your favorite launch points. What would you order for your last meal? I'd order the fish or steak tacos at my favorite Mexican restaurant or like an entire pizza just to myself. Thank <laughs> you.